So, <clears throat> I actually already finished watching the episode that I was, that I'm supposed to watch today. Naisip ko, parang gagawin ko na lang one take yung ano, mga video ko para hindi ko na siya in-edit sa, ano, sa power director. Pero wala siyang ano dito. Here, I think, or dito yata. I don't know. Dito yata. Wala na siyang... Bustayon, lang watermark. So, uh, Ultra Q, 1966, episode 8. Uh, di ko alam yung title. Titignan ko lang siya. Uh, di rin kasi sinabi dun sa, sa episode. Uh, pero it's about, it's about a giant mole. And that's basically it. <laughs> Terror of the Sweet Honey. So, it's about this uh this uh, no, honey yeah it's about this honey uh that comes from a bee tapos this honey pagka kinonsume siya lalaki yung mga ano yung mga nagconsume dun sa ano, dun sa honey na yun para ayun magiging kaiju sila instant kaiju so um Ewan ko, yun, sobrang basic nung story niya. So, that's good, ba? That's good. So, you can say less is more, diba? Pero, when it comes to the human aspect, when it comes to the human story, when it comes to the plot, medyo, ano, parang, ewan ko, parang, trinay nilang i-complicate yung story with the human characters, <coughs> with the human conflict. There are these two scientists, scientist one and scientist two. Um, I don't care about their names, so they're scientists. Tapos parang yung isang scientist yata, galit siya dun sa scientist na isa. Scientist one, galit siya kay scientist two, kasi scientist two. Ma ano, parang may babae din na ano yun. So parang love triangle or something like that. Um, Pero, I don't know. That doesn't really matter when it comes to, you know, to do to the focus of the episode. Um, the the real focus of this episode is really about, you know, the, the there's, you know, parang there's there comes this giant mole. Na it used to be just a regular mole, pero ano yun nakonsume niya yung ano yung yung honey, yung strange honey that gives them. That gives anyone who consumes it the ano, enhanced mass or ano, size. Yun, bigla sila lalaki. Um, you know, there's many. There are many ways where this episode could have, you know, could have went, and they chose to, ano, they chose to focus, ano, on that, ano, that scientist scientist number one and his conflict with the other scientist and then the other when and then the girl the girlfriend the one um, scientist number two scientist number one yun nga para siyang galit like to take ng revenge or something i don't really care about uh, that aspect um kasi mas interesting yun yun yung yung papansinin mo lang yung ano yung yung recurring cast na ano yun din ano parang ini-investigate nila yung yung bagong ano yung bagong uh, case na to na bakit ano bakit uh, may mga may may malaking mole na ano na biglang ano uh, sir ano biglang lumitaw sa ano sa mun, sa sa land or sa sa sa, sa lupa <coughs> pero hindi hindi nila ginawa hindi nila ginawa yun they focused on more things on other things parang okay na na ano eh okay na yung first part eh pero parang ano kailangan siguro ano nandito yung government nandito yung ano blah blah ganyan I mean there's nothing wrong with interference of the military pero yung scientist 
um, part ng ano, scientist sub story or side story or uh, yun parang hindi necessary na ano na parang hindi kailangan na i-complicate nila ng ganun yung ano, yung po, yung part nung ano nung plot nung episode na yun pwedeng ano parang pwedeng there's just one scientist na ano na nag-create nung ano nung or nag-re-research uh, nung 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 strange honey na yun tapos parang ano wala parang may ano siguro may pet siya na ano na let's say pet niya yung mole just to give the scientist and the mole some ano some some kind of connection di ba kasi i don't know the the mole doesn't have any specific uh, ano, specific uh, connection to any of the characters i mean in the previous episodes ano like hmm yun <laughs> actually marami dito yung defeat Gomez kahit pa paano may ano may sense siya na ano kasi may di ba dalawa yung ano yung yung <laughs> uh, I'm finding these I'm finding this series very you know very dull very mundane because I mean if you compare it to ano, I mean what they got right with this episode with, the, with episode 8 is ano, the the miniature sets nagandahan ako dun sa miniature sets kahit pa ano, sobrang ano siya yung quality niya is similar to ano or is ano parang equal siya dun sa miniature sets ng ano ng normal na kaiju movie mga Godzilla movies Mothra uh, Ghidorah blah 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 ah uh, yun parang dun ako nagandahan dun sa part na yun sana dun sila nag focus or dun ano parang hindi na sana talaga ano it's just uh, parang Trinay nilang isiksik yung sobrang, sobrang, ano, grand na story na to. Into an episode, into a 25 minute episode. Parang yun yun nangyari. They wanted to do a movie in less than 25 minutes. You don't do that. You, you deduct and deduct and, um, uh, subtract and, um, take away remove uh, unnecessary things when you're trying to uh, first write a short story or a screenplay a short screenplay and then try to um, try to make that thing into a short film or a short episode or an episode I mean you already have a recurring cast so that those are the characters you, that you only have to focus on you don't have to put different characters or yeah you don't have to do you don't have to put new characters you could you could have you could have just the recurring cast and one or two I know newer characters and then focus on the plot focus on the conflict focus on um, simplicity of the story that's that's how you do these things. I mean, let's take for example Mammoth Flower and the Gift from Space. Um, the Gift from Space is, I know, um, yun, it's open ended. It's about an alien slug or these eggs, these ran, ano, parang eggs na mukha siyang ano, golden, ano golden shit na ano na ganun. Tapos pagka na ano na initan or na ano parang biglang ano magha-hatch siya into these ano to these giant slugs and the people there, the characters have to deal with that and they do that in the episode. And then Mammoth Flower is about a giant ass flower and 
the people have to deal with it they don't have to like you know figure out or like uh, try to you know do a lot of exposition as to why or how or blah 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 they just have to deal with it they just have to present uh, ways on in order to you know, in order to fucking um, deal with the the current situation they don't have to like ex- do a lot of exposition for new characters or you know they have to make they have to bring the message home and have the message be simple enough in order for people to understand uh, as simple as possible as easy as possible parang the gift from space was very com- ano, parang commentary siya about ano eh, about space travel eh, and then and man's um, my man's unending search for ano for uh, new things or for undiscovered things and mammoth flower is basically you know what if a what if story now what if a giant flower suddenly pops out of you know, a building and causes er- causes earthquakes and then appears in the middle of the city as a giant ass flower and this flower comes from you know, from a thousand or uh, a million years ago parang you know, just a simple story pero itong itong terror of the sweet honey it had the potential of being a good episode it had the potential of being a good episode pero with with the scientist again with the scientist um that i don't know broke uh broke into this you know parang uh, greenhouse or something then parang parang ano eh parang ano f- forced <laughs> parang forced yung ano yung yung development ng character or whatever happened in the character it was forced parang hindi kailangan siya talaga eh so yun parang nainis lang ako dun sa episode na to kasi yun nga they tried to make a movie in less than 25 minutes a full film in less than 25 minutes. Yun yung parang scope nung ano eh, nung episode na to eh. Like, I could see this as a movie. And it would work as a movie, pero they they only had 25 minutes to to fucking squish everything together. And what the happened, uh, what happened afterwards is gonna be something that I would rate as a two out of five. Never pa ako nagbigay ng one, so I'm very generous when it comes to them. When it comes to this episode, kasi kahit pa paano, the miniature sets uh, were were good. Pero ano, walang sense yung miniature sets kung pangit naman yung ano, yung story. Kasi story is king. Come on, we already know this. So, 2 out of 5 stars, like and subscribe if you have not already, hit the bell to get notified, and I'll see you in the next one.